Raptors, Pajez making his return. He's been out the back, he had to replace the brake lever on his bike, and uh, he's got uh, one of the special components he has on that bike. That bike weighs 84 kilos, which is about 13 kilos less than a regular freestyle bike. It's covered in carbon fiber, fully custom, head to toe, to make it so much lighter, and that's why you see Tom do the tricks he does. But this is make or break right now. This is to do what he did in Minneapolis, come from the back to the front. He's His last in jump last out there place. was a double backflip. His next one is going to be a double backflip. To, to overcome those nerves, this is how you do it. Oh! Yeah. That was insane. How could he come back after crashing that and then throw no hands? Thomas Pachez on the first trick! Did you see him stop there, look at the crowd and nod, just say, yeah, that's what's up. That's what I came here There's for, the he vault. says. There's the vault, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to call it right now. You might as well grab some popcorn, sit back, and enjoy the Thomas Pages show because uh, even after that huge crash in the first the run... The pipe. this is risky. Ho hopefully Tom can get this one down. He is feeling it right now. It could be the bike flip. One of those tricks... This is the bike. The Thomas trick. Thomas Pages, the only person who does it. Yeah. And he brings it around! Unreal, Thomas. Unbelievable. I mean, it's hard to be here in the booth right now and sit here and talk about it. I just want to watch this guy ride because when Thomas is on, Thomas he is on. on. Ali Flair. Is this real life? No, this is a video game. Yeah. Yes. Thomas Pachez is putting on a clinic here at X Games Sydney. And those two tricks that he just done are not so much high risk tricks as far as injury with the height, but such high risk that they're so easy to mess up and they've cost him wins. The margin pass. for error, Razor 360. Yes. Yes. 360. That is incredible. Spotless Stadium is going nuts right now. See Harry being down there, obviously he'd be bitterly disappointed with his shoulder coming out. He's scheduled for surgery in a couple of weeks, have that fixed, but right now let's just sit back and watch Thomas Pages and do the Thomas Pages show. Amazing, amazing stuff after crashing his first jump. Huge flat on it, huge extension. You see how sideways that six then? Did you see how sideways that bike was? And that is it, that's his six jump. Uh, we I, talked about it all show long. Pajez, it took him 10 years to get his first freestyle gold medal. He did it earlier this summer. Look at this, look at this. Whoa! That was, that was massive. Did because you see he his throttle up. hand? He nearly missed his throttle hand. He was fingertips on the throttle when he got back. And if that, that would have been disaster. So motivating to see Thomas come back after that crash too. That, that, Really does right. take some. We weren't sure and if we were going a, to see him out here for that was number a huge two. Huge impact. You see there the vault, that was what we were talking, the difference between that and the Kelly roll. Here, the bike flip. No, that's the op opposite flare, Alley -oop. Alley -oop flare. You don't even know that he he's actually got it. it. Perfect. And then lands, as you said, Jacko, just point and shoot. But at one point there, he's facing backwards, upside down, the wrong way. You see, getting con congrats from Sheeny, from Harry. I mean, congrats from up there in the booth. I mean, I'm not even going to see the this score is, come in. This is a, yeah, this is a 95. Be close. A 96.66 on the final run of the contest. Uh -huh. Pajaj reclaims gold. Well done, Tom. Back good. to back for Thomas Pajaj, especially after that double flip crash, to come over the nerves of crashing in the first run and then come out and stomp a run like that. I mean, that Gentlemen, was... an all-time performance, right? I mean, for Thomas Pajaj, we talked about it. Finally, <laughs> getting that first freestyle goal at X Games Minneapolis this year. Now Six. he goes two for two.